Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol HEXO. We will take a look at the 30-minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30-minute, I offer an explanation video at that link. Did this analysis on Tuesday, so that is where the green line here is coming from, and that's also where the first update comes into play. And this update is just based on a foundational rule in charting, which states when levels of support are broken and closed below, they tend to act as resistance. So let's get to this level of change of resistance. Now, going into the day, 50 cents here was going to be that level that, you know, definitely you want to see the price stay up above, but unfortunately the price did fall below it. And then from there, you can see that's what essentially opened up the downwards momentum right there. Now to give some credit where credit's due, at least the price didn't just sit here and do something like this all day long and bleed and bleed and bleed. The price was able to at least start to go sideways here, which is a good start. Now it does that, in, and I wish I could say trading was this easy, just because it was bleeding further and further down. And then went sideways, I wish I could say, that means that this is for sure the bottom. Now, that, there's a little bit more to trade in that. My point is, it's at least a valid, it's at least a rational thought to have that. You know, yeah, maybe this is some sort of bottom that's trying to take shape here. So if it is, and the you know the, the price continues to work its way back upwards, then that first big test from the resistance side of things, again, is gonna be right up there at 50 cents. So definitely 50 cents gonna be a very revealing level. But the other very revealing level, and there's nothing complicated behind this at all, is just, well, let's see if the price can continue to hold above 48 cents. Because as of right now, it's more than valid to say, well, this looks like it's, you know, could be the bottom. And you're right, because, well, several times today it proved to be the bottom. So again, if this is going to be some sort of bottom that's forming, well, then by default, by definition, you want to continue to see 48 cents hold. So from that angle of things, like I said, just from a very common sense approach, yeah, that level is important in terms of helping us discover whether or not this is some sort of bottom. So 48 cents, key level of support. 50 cents key level of resistance headed into Thursday. So let's see what happens and see if this thing can get a, a nice size bounce to the upside. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.